What's going on, my YouTube family? How's everybody doing today? Beautiful, beautiful, cool morning. That's how I'm doing this morning. Nice and cool. I am loving this. This is the weather we work hard for, my friends. September 2nd, fall is approaching. I can feel that nice, cool air approaching in. And man, it makes things really enjoyable for doing the outdoor activities and all of our recreational firewood or stuff. That's right. <laughs> And also, I'm enjoying this long hair now. So yeah, the people who've been mocking me about it, oh yeah, it's not so bad now, is it? <laughs> hope everybody's doing okay. Hope everybody's surviving that storm that traveled up the East Coast over there. Del Casal, people along the East Coast, I hope you guys are okay. Our thoughts and prayers are always with you, my friends. Anybody across the globe who is in dire situation, I hope everybody's okay. Another beautiful day on God's planet, filled with firewood, fun-filled activities. And we're out here this morning. I get a lot of questions from you, my friends, and how long does it take me to fill up the trailer with a load of split wood with the processor? And this morning, I'm gonna share that with you, my friends, and how long it takes to fill up the trailer with split load, a full load of five face cord. If anybody knows what face cords are, a lot of people get mixed up between cord and face cord. A cord is three face cord, and a face cord is four feet tall, eight feet long, 16 to 18 inches deep. Anybody who doesn't know that, I'm sharing that with you now, my friends. I measure my wood by face cord, not cord. You can say whatever you want. Five face would be a little over a cord and a half per se, and then so on and so forth. Six face, two cord. It gets, gets quite complicating for some people. I know it gets complicating for me at times, so you gotta be careful. Some people will order 10 cord and they're talking about 30 face. With that being said, I am doing five face cord, my friends, which fills up the Cam Superline dump trailer pretty much full, right to the top, all the way back with a slight taper down to the tailgate for safe travels. That gives me a very good five face cord and conservative for my customers that have a little bit extra, which I would prefer rather than a little less. I've already brought the pile of logs over here, just cut them in half from the big log pile out in front. If anybody's been watching the previous videos, my big log pile out in the front there, I cut them logs in half because they're long. Truck them up the driveway here with the Delicacel backhoe, drop them right next to the processor, which I can load with little Bob with the forks onto the deck of the processor and it works out great. My umbrella's looking a little sad this morning. It doesn't have any, any sun to shade. <laughs> so how am I going to share with you, my friends, and how we're going to keep track with how long it takes to load this trailer with five face cord? I'm going to set a timer. You guys are going to watch it, me popping in occasionally, and where you guys can see exactly how long it takes. This video is going to be shorter than the actual time it takes so that I can share with you guys and how long it takes to fill this trailer, but in a reasonable time matter. I don't want anybody getting really bored here now. <laughs> what are you doing, Hope? What are you doing? Come on. <laughs> uh oh, what do you see? Here are our victims of choice. Beautiful mix. Have some ash in there, hard maple, soft maple, occasional stick of cherry, and a lot of beech. This stuff's gonna run through beautiful. You guys can see, I don't think there's anything over 12 inches. Nice straight material, occasional knot. I don't think it's going to affect little Diney any bit. Giving my jaw a rest and flailing my hand some more, we're going to get to it and do what we do best, my friends. Make firewood. You know, we're moving the stopwatch to its own little landing pad here. The old Dell Cassell excavating custom hoodie. Tom, the truck bed is nice and clean. Don't worry. <laughs> but there it is, my friends. And I'm also going to keep the time running through me changing the camera around here so you guys can get an idea of that as well but take that in consideration whereas the times where i don't need to mess around with the camera it's much more quick
An hour and 20 minutes, guys. Unbelievable. That may be, honestly, a new record. Five face cord in the trailer. I know where it is, and I know my measurement in the dump trailer. Dump trailer is 14 foot long, 84 inches wide on the inside, and about four feet tall from the bottom to the top of the sides. Five face comes beautifully over halfway and then tapers down to the back of the doors. It's a really good gauge. I've had plenty of customers who stack it and tell me that I'm spot on, if not a little heavy, which I would prefer so that nobody's shorted. And as you guys can see, the processor just whittled through that stuff. Some beautiful gravy train pole wood that Diney had no problem feeding through. We've got a nice pile left over for the next one. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Hour and 20 minutes, five face cord in the trailer. Now we head down the road and we deliver it. Be good to each other. Be kind, my friends. Stick together. And we'll see you guys on the next one. I love each and every one of you so much. Thank you guys so much for the support. Thank you for all the new faces joining the channel. That wood guy here. Over and out, my friends. See you guys later. I'll see you on the next one. Enjoy the weather. See ya.